G'day and welcome back to our Polish secret weapon campaign in Hearts of Iron 4. So we are trying to rescue this little 19 stack that was encircled. Luckily, they're not looking too bad at the moment. Though, yeah, it's 8 on 8. He's going to be able to do that pretty quickly. Does he still have... No, he has supply there now. Alright, so we need to get some men in here ASAP. That is going extremely poorly, as expected. So, stop them. Alright, need these other guys to be safe as well. So, get out of that. Yeah, don't worry. Come on, buddy. Well, I think you're going to win that now. If you are, we'll help out. I'm sure he's going to move some more troops down there. Alright, you get in. Alright, we can defend there. That little organisation is just going to keep dropping there. This guy is going the wrong direction. I guess he can chill there for a bit. Not if you're going to be an idiot. Stay there. Alright, improved artillery. It's always good. Too far ahead of time for the rest. It's 1940. Weapons 3 is going to be worth going ahead of time. Looks like we've retaken this province. Just barely. That's okay. They are getting very low on their organisation. So... We're not going to be able to stab through there because he's reinforcing it. Down here, we've just lost this province. Alright, who gets in first? We've got one day and eight. He's got one day and five. This guy's retreating out into the middle of nowhere. So, we need to try to make sure we can keep that. This guy is going to retreat after all. This guy's going to come with him. Alright, if we can hold that, that's okay. We didn't want to... No, stop. Didn't want to get choked off there. Alright, I don't see any way that we're going to be able to rescue them. And they're all actually dying now anyway. Ah, oh, crap. That's a large chunk of our army. It's an eighth. And this is going poorly. So, let's get some reinforcements in there, I guess. And leave this open, which is a little deadly. So we'll have a stab at them as well. <clears throat> it's looking reasonable. Definitely want to get some of these guys. Keep trying to push towards Kiev. <clears throat> Alright, what do we reckon here? No, not yet. Not until this defense is finished. Uh... This guy is going to need to help out there. <clears throat> Alright, overall, we are doing a lot worse. Alright, advanced computing machines. That's nicely ahead of time. Two years ahead. A year and a bit. These are probably not worth doing. But we're going to grab some nuclear reactors. Start the research now. Yeah, so that's what we just lost there. Which would be about half of this. Alright, might be time. Yep, it's time. Alright. Everybody stop. You guys come down to the river. We will cancel this order. Don't know where the order came from anyway. Okay, and then we're going to want a fallback line across there. And we'll grab a swath of people from the north and just attach them to this. 26 divisions in looks like three provinces. Hopefully they'll be able to defend it and the rest of them will stick along the front line still. Alright, just retreat in an orderly fashion poles. Give me like the German border is still freaking massively undefended. Goddamn Soviets. If they'd given us until their focus was done. If they would just waited until claims on Poland, we would have conquered freaking Germany. Oh. All of you, get out of there. Quickly, don't get overrun. There we go. Alright. Continue the retreat. Don't you dare. 
Get in, get in, get in, get in. Good. Alright. This guy retreats. These guys, you have to be careful not to get cut off. Our fleet's going to be kicked out. <laughs> there goes France. Wow. Holy crap, Italy. Okay. Well. <laughs> Almost saved our men. We could make a valiant last stand there, actually. Since they have to retreat across the line anyway. It'd be a better spot for them, I guess. But as soon as they're done, they'll pull back. And Paris has fallen, yes. Okay. Next problem will be if they cut us across here. Because then they'll just wander on. So, what are you going to do to protect against that? No idea. We could pop out these 20 divisions. That might very soon be necessary. Alright, if we do, we would want them to come to... Probably count us. Let's make it Bialystok, just to be safe. Alright, down in the south... Things are not looking bad, but not particularly good either. Would have loved to have gotten this area. Okay, that's a river crossing, so I'm not going to do that. These seven look incapable of doing much. As does everybody up here. Alright. Get in there and help defend the river crossing. Uh, here's where all the guys have gone. Hmm. Alright, that looks decent. Our guys here are going to start getting pushed back across the river. Massive breakthrough, he's got freaking tanks. The death of Rudolf Hess. And now we're going to lose part of our goddamn defensive line. Hmm. Well, I guess there's nothing wrong with creating the next fallback line. I'm going to go too close to Warsaw, but somewhere along this side of the river. I'm not going to put men on it yet. Make sure nobody's trying to wander through. I'm trying to do some attacks, apparently. Hmm. All right. What's the chance that we can win a war of attrition against the Soviets? Pretty damn bad. We lost most of our manpower. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I did two practices of this one, and they both went a hell of a lot better than this. The first time, the Soviets kept uh, justifying claims, but they never actually declared war, so I could overrun the Germans. Yeah, see, they got all their guys back on the border now, so we're screwed. And, uh, yeah, the second time, we were semi-allied to Russia because of the war against Finland that the Allies somehow joined. So I don't understand that. Alright, we're pushed back over here. Yeah, I really want to hold them back there. All depends on how this river can be held. Looking alright there. And some of these divisions are weakening. But just nowhere near as much as we need them to. How's everything else? Oh, infantry equipment. Holy crap. Yeah, that'll definitely be an issue. Italy lays claims to Greece. Greece join the Allies. We are definitely not going to join the Allies. We'll just be ruffle stomped by the Reich. Hmm. Well, whatever planes we've got left, let's just throw them into the air. They'll last about six seconds against these 700 planes, 700 fighters. Alright, supply is absolutely fine, but I don't like him standing there or there. If we can get up to that river, might help us out a little. Oh, get these guys in to help. And I guess these guys, since they won't be needed there anymore. Seven, three, four, six, seven there. Seven on seven, but it's in the marshes. 
would like to do it because he's got relatively low strength. Got eight and nine there. He's got too many reinforcements if we attack that. Just too many Soviets around. He's got 500 to our 150. Alright, Belgium capitulated. Now, Japan is not at war with the Soviet Union yet. That's what we need. German-French war. So, Axis and Allies, and then just Comintern and us. Means he can focus on us and we can't get any relief from anywhere. Now, this is not good. How far are you going, buddy? How about you just... Where are you going? You just stop there. This guy will also stop there. These guys will get this party started. It's going to be a loss. Alright, Poland first. Then there was the extra national unity from ideological fanaticism. Alright, we can modify our government. Um... Don't need anything else there because we can't make any use of it. So I think we just store up the points until manpower's zeroed out. I'll have to get them involved. Why is this so bad? He is entrenched a great deal. We are suffering combat width. Yeah, well, bring a guy back and you won't suffer that. Low manpower, modify, right? yep. Alright, losing it down here. So we should do something to help. That offensive is a complete not a failure. But, this one went better. Alright, we need to help out. This defense will be fine. I'm going to push them further up the river as soon as they're finished repulsing that attack. Right, these seven at least. Uh, start there. So we send just over half this way. He will be involved. They'll be involved. That should be alright. Now, this side into the marshes should be an easy one. So he's starting to pull a lot of his troops back from the places that we want to retake. Do need to be careful in the north. Netherlands are gone, so Germany's done with Europe. Hopefully he won't fabricate a claim on us. He's already got um, Danzig, and he's given up his claim on Poznan. I'd like to do a push from here, but it's a bit dangerous. There's a battle plan. Oh yeah, that one. Okay. Go away. Air superiority in everywhere that we are. Alright, better industry. Three years, that is not going to be worth it yet. Alright, that's fine. Engineering, that's too far ahead. Experimental rockets is too far ahead. Not going to bother with radar. 40, no. Armor, 41. Let's go for this. 34 days, holy crap. Okay. Now they're looking almost weak enough. Let's throw half there, half there. We'll just throw one of them down. Don't want to do river crossings. Because we want to hold the river, so he has to do river crossings. Alright, that was construction. The next one, probably not worth it. Artillery, 42. We'd have to make them, so that's not worth it. Now, infiltration. Sure. Let's get started on some of them. Now, <laughs> two one two six, probably not the best odds. Let's get these guys up there. They look like they're all redeploying. Let's get all but one of these guys helping. All right, that's the couple up there that we're trying to capture. Let's go seven and seven. These eight are heading off a long way. Try and get them out here. And if they can wrap around behind, that'd be great. Alright, 
that's not looking good. You go help defend. And you. Mountaineer down here. Alright, better hurry up. Get in there. How far out? Two? How the hell was it taking him that long? Where are you? Alright, you. Speed, 1.6. Because air superiority. Crap. Alright. Mm, yeah, it's not going to go well. But we're now defending, so it looks like we won that territory. Of course, all these guys are just walking straight past where we need them. We have to at least send half these guys up. No, let's just be careful. Don't want to be encircled down here again, but we're going to anyway. Damn it. Mm. Can't do a counter-attack there yet. He's got too many guys coming in. Alright, these guys are going to pull back. No, who's... Who? Who? You? Stop. Okay. Almost fell for his little encirclement gambit up there. Damn it. Defending again. Just needed to send them up. There. Alright. Hold the line. We are looking okay in the north now. It's this bit that's going to be the bigger worry. So, with whoever is standing around right at this particular point in time, try and retake this forest. Grodno, unfortunately, is on the east side of the river. Alright, they're looking weak. So let's give these a push. Stop his reinforcements. You get up here and help. That's alright. That's alright. That's alright. That's bad. Hmm. Alright. No point in losing any manpower there. So we'll pull them out. How are we looking? Soviets lost 1.8. Alright. Back up to 3 to 1. Inventory equipment that we desperately need, so we can't afford to switch over. 1940, we're getting close to mechanised. Support's 42, armour, doing the thing for the 10 bees soon. It's 42, that is 180 days out. They're useless. Engineering, well, might be worth doing rockets, I guess, though. Construction, that's way too far ahead. Alright, we don't have any resources, so this is going to be kind of a boondoggle, but we'll give it a go. Alright, now we're losing that goddamn province, so we have to pull everybody back. Because if we lose, well, see if they start attacking, then we'll pull everybody back through here. There's two provinces here that if they take, would we'll lose another 25 odd divisions. Ah, oh, that's tons of guys. Alright, you know screw it. We're pulling back. You stop moving forward. Alright, grab our front line. It is going to come just to there. You guys need to hold this at all costs. Which I guess means that'll go there for now. You pull back. Defend. There we go. Defend it until everyone's in there. And you can all retreat as one happy family. Alright, the front line's already closed in. Okay, back to the north. My TP chart. Good. Um, we'll want this eventually, so I might as well research it now. What are we doing here? Alright, fanaticism. Okay, the front's looking green in a lot of the places we need it to. Really need to make sure we don't lose a single province now though. 
he's just got crazy freaking numbers. And we've popped out a bunch of new guys. And... Well, no, we don't have the equipment anymore. Yeah, that's bad. Alright. And it's top of our list as well. We need 30,000. Screw it. We're just gonna do what we can here. And we'll queue up the next infantry equipment. Three to be top of the list. Because we are still making factories, although we're losing them faster than we're making them. Production efficiency cap. Right. Uh, we need... Well, it would have been nice to have one of these before, but we're going to need efficiency growth eventually, since we only actually have, what, three lines at the moment anyway. Alright, get in there. Defend. Defend, defend, defend. Forget that province. Defend that one. You. Get up there and defend. 12 hours. Painful. Ah, oh, crap. You know, they're going to encircle these guys here anyway. Hmm. Alright, there is a ridiculous amount of redeployment going on. We're not doing any attacks, so let's just cancel everybody. Cancel their moves, they'll defend where they are. And then do their redeployments afterwards. Good. Okay, well, we can take a short break here while the... God damn it. While the line is mostly green. So, thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think in the comments. And I hope to see you again soon. See you later.